On one side, one on the other. Take it out of your pan. Hello, I'm Austin Cobb, Executive Chef. We're here with Dorasi today. We're featuring an A5 Japanese Wagyu ribeye. Over here we have our accouchement. We have a little bit of lime, chive, radish, wasabi, Florida cell, and if you want to kick it up a notch, we're going to finish it with some Dorasi caviar. So we have our A5 ribeye Wagyu steak right here. This is the proper preparation for how we're going to serve it. So what I like to do is cut it into blocks like this. You want to make sure you have a sharp knife, long cuts like this. We're going to take that, put it on a plate, get it ready for seasoning. We're going to keep it really simple. This is a high-end product, so what we want to do is just season it with a little bit of sea salt. Lightly season it because they're thin pieces of meat. We're going to put that down. And we have a hot pan over here. You don't even need to put any oil down because it has enough fat, so it's going to render up pretty quickly. You want to take this guy, give it a quick sear, it's pretty fast. Okay, so here we are, seared A5. One minute on the one side, one minute on the other. Take it out of your pan. So now we have our seared A5 Wagyu ribeye right here. We've cut it into little strips. So then after that, we're gonna slice it. Make sure you give it a rest. That way it stays nice and juicy. I'm gonna take this, do nice elongated cuts like that. Boom. Boom, kind of nuggy bits right there, showing off the color. This I suggest eating a bite, so you have a nice balanced bite. You have the very fatty Wagyu, and then you want to cut it with a little bit of acid and some spice. A little bit of wasabi, a little dabble do ya. Boom, some chili, spice up your life. Then you have a little radish, a couple chives, a little bit of our beautiful Dorasti caviar with your mother pearl spoon, very important. And then we're gonna finish it with a little squeeze of lime. Boom.